Hey guys, Scrublord here, and welcome to another episode of Scrub Souls. In this episode, we are going to be taking an SL1 character through the uh, Dancer of the Boreal Valley um, boss fight. And I really scrubbed this one up, um, but I guess there's a lot of value to that. I think a lot of people assume that, you know, an SL1, oh, I just be dying constantly, all the bosses are going to one-shot me. And you realize that you know, I take a lot of hits here. I use all of my Estus and somehow managed to come away with a victory. Um, she doesn't really have a lot of shots that will one-shot you, so you'll be kind of surprised at how much easier this fight is than you would assume. That's not to say, of course, that this fight wasn't difficult for me. I died far more than I did on any of the bosses up to this point. I have killed through Volnir. I have not gone into Hero yet. Um, and the reason I did this is I'm coming back in order to try to get the Knight's Ring so that I can have a 100% block shield going into some of the more difficult parts of the game in Irithyll. So by taking out the Dancer, I'll be able to get that Knight's Ring. I'll also be posting this video along with a little bit deeper explanation of, you know, what I'm wearing, what I'm using, and all that kind of jazz on my actual SL1 walkthrough. Um, so if you are interested in, in trying to do an SL1, um, you can check that out. I'll be doing levels as opposed to just bosses and showing you where to, you know, what items are critical to pick up and, and whatnot. Whereas this one, I'm just, just doing the boss. Um, and those videos aren't very long. I'm keeping them maybe 8 to 12 minutes or so for the most part. Um, we'll see how that goes. And we might end up with some longer levels as we go on. Um, but they're fairly short. They're not just a full playthrough. So as you can see, she's really chewing up my Estus. And I make that mistake twice where I try to punish that, which you can in the first phase, but in the second phase when she does that jump, she'll do a spin at the end, so you don't want to try to punish that. But she just keeps on just nicking me, and I keep on surviving. I thought that would have been, I think that's probably the blue tear stone ring that saved my life on that one. And that's it. Dance for the Boreal Valley with an SL1 character. So, uh, thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe, and check my other videos to see the walkthrough.